Remember that a complex number is any number written in the form a plus b times i, where a and b are real numbers and i is the imaginary unit. Every polynomial equation with complex coordinates and a degree greater than zero has at least one root in the set of complex numbers. This is according to the fundamental theorem of algebra. Complex numbers are made up of all real numbers and imaginary numbers. A polynomial equation with degree n will have n roots in the set of complex numbers. Let's solve the below polynomial equation and determine its number of roots. Here we have the equation x squared minus 4x plus 4 is equal to 0. We can factor this to x minus 2 squared is equal to 0. In this case, x equals 2 is our root. Putting in 2 makes this equation correct. This polynomial equation has one repeating root. That is, it has x equals 2 twice, which makes for one repeating root. Descartes' rule of signs can be used to determine the number of positive real zeros, negative real zeros, and imaginary zeros in a polynomial function. It is the topic of our next lecture.